I'm starting to do it again. Let's get into this thing. I'm going to be talking about the Adidas EQT's Advance versus the Adidas Energy Cloud Cloud Phone. So let's do it. First of all, let's talk about the EQT's. So this is like a nice little bag that you get. But inside it, this is from Adidas as you can see. Right, and this is what you get when you buy running trainers. And when you buy like normal kind of trainers like Adidas Superstars or any of those kind of trainers, you get like a white bag, I'll show you that. These are the knit suede that Adidas uses for the EQTs with this type of foam. This is actually foam, this is not rubber. Well, it's like rubber as well, but it is a, most, it's a foam, basically. It's ethylene, ethylene vinyl acetate, which is basically a copolymer, yeah, foam. And it's the reason this day you're starting to use these is because they're very durable, they're flexible, they're comfortable, and, you know, you're able to use a thing called um, TPU welding, yeah, or moulding or whatever, where you fuse basically plastics or certain materials together for textiles. And that's why these are really cool, instead of using like glue and all that kind of bullshit. Yeah, well there is a, a type of glue, like, you know, whatever they can use, but this is a better form of it. And my design basically is, as I said, the synthetic suede with the rubber sole here. And I changed it here, so you see I put it as black as this bit here. And this bit, I did black sole with red stripes. Yeah, and the reason I did that is because I wanted this trainer, because this is an iconic 90s trainer, whereas the Adidas um, Superstars was an uh, iconic 80s trainer. Yeah, you'll see the theme that I'm coming up with in a minute. Yeah, so Superstars 80s, these 90s, re reimagining of an 80s, 90s classic. Yeah, and um, these ones, I wanted it to be very, the contrast to be powerful. Yeah, that's why I see, look, white against the red. White against the red. Black against the red. White against the black. Black against the red, white against the red. So it's very contrasty, even here. Black laces against the red. I want it to be very contrasty, very powerful. Right, even look on the inside, you see here, it says Lionheart in there. Because when you customize, these are one of a kind basically. That's what's so cool about the Adidas customization option is the fact that you can customize whatever you like. You can customize the trainers, the colors, you can pick some material, different materials in terms of the trainers and in terms of the clothing. It's really fucking awesome, man. I love it. Yeah, and on the inside, as you can see, I did this black, the lining. You can change the color of the lining, basically. And mine is a ten and a half. Yeah, um, ten and a half size. Yeah, the soles, they look cool, but in terms of grip, I'm not too sure. I have to give, I feel, I feel like I want to give the grip a 7 out of 10. No, a 6 out of 10, basically. That's how I feel I want to, because I've worn these trains already, and they don't feel the most grippy. Like, to what the Adidas Superstars, there is no better grip. Than, well, actually, there is. But those ones feel bloody hell, like your foot is like, sucked to the floor and stuck there. Right, they're so grippy and strong. And these just feel very light, but I think that's the style. The style was it's meant to not be grippy, so that your feet can just move in a certain way, unhindered, almost like you're running on bare feet. Yeah, that's why the heel has got like, the heel has actually got a good grip on them, and so is the toe. So it might be the idea of what these trainers are when you're running, right? And that's where the sole comes in, using um, ethylene vinyl acetate foam, yeah? It's the fact that it's so flexible, and it's so comfortable, yet it's durable. I don't know, I'm not a technical person or whatever, but I'm just thinking maybe that's why they did it. So I love these trainers, they're absolutely fantastic design. In terms of comfort, I'll give these an uh, 7 out of 10. I'll give them a 7 out of 10 in terms of comfort, but in terms of the look, I'll give these an easy 10 out of 10. I will give these a 10 out of 10. Free! In terms of design, that's an easy 10 out of 10. So I'll give it 10 out of 10 for style, um, in terms of comfort, I give it a 7 out of 10. Yeah, so that's these ones. And now, let me show you the... Uh, put them there for a second. Energy Cloud. Yeah, so this is what they call the Energy Cloud. Cloud foam. Look on the inside. It says Lionheart. Lionheart! Yeah, customise that. Inside, black. Outside, red. 
scarlet red with black cage, red foam sole, midsole, and red outer sole. Love it. Shout out to Final Fantasy 15. And yeah, man, like these trainers, they're heavier. That's the first thing I would feel between the Adidas Energy Cloud and the Adidas EQTs is these are more heavier. They are more heavier, definitely. But they are more comfortable. In terms of comfort, I'd give these a 9 out of 10. These get a 9 out of 10 in terms of comfort. And in terms of look, I would give these a... I mean, personally, I like it. I love them up to the front. The back still looks cool, still looks good. But um, that's where it falls down a little bit, is the back is this whole cage thing. I don't get the whole cage thing too much, right? But I do like it. I do like, I don't understand what it's there for, whether it supports it or I'm not too sure. But um, yeah, it's cool. But when I look at it just like that, it's absolutely incredible. I love it. I love the whole trainer, to be honest with you. But if you look at it just like that, mate, personally, I'd give that a 9 out of 10. But I have to judge it as a whole shoe. So as a whole shoe, the design, I would give this a 8 out of 10 in terms of the whole design. And the comfort, 9 out of 10. If I was to say which one is better out of the EQT and the NG Cloud, I would basically say EQTs are better. Because they are comfortable and the design is godlike. Yeah? Now, in terms of these ones, the comfort is godlike. And the look is very, is very nice. Yeah? But it's personal preference. I would always wear these instead of the EQTs simply because they are more comfortable. Yeah? And I like the way they look on my foot. So it's a personal preference. But I do look at them both and I know which one is better in terms of as a whole, yeah. Superstars 80s, EQ2s 90s, Cloud Foam 1000s. They're gen generational, essentially. And let me just show you something quickly, it's just a little bit of a treat, right, so... Thank you. I've got two of them. So I've got one in white, grey, fading into black. With the soles, the cloud foam, fade silver into black, white soles, white cage, white inner sole. So if you look inside, inside the lining is white and it says line heart. Cool, huh? So yeah, yeah, yeah. I love these trainers, man. These are, for me, I think the... Cloud foams are the better one for me because I like super casual and comfort over style. That's just me, right? So, yeah, those are the two trainers that I did with the Energy Cloud. Real, real awesome. And these are the EQTs that I made, right? <sighs> these are the better trainers. Personally, they're the better trainers. So I would recommend that you put take yourself over to the adidas.co.uk and just check out them trainers, man. Check out them trainers. You can do so many different custom designs. Look, with these ones, you see I put Bayonetta because Bayonetta, I love Bayonetta. That is my bay, yeah? And these trainers, I want to make them dedicated to Bayonetta. You know what I'm saying? But we're all different. Everybody's different. So these are the trainers that I made. The Adidas. Superstars, the Energy Cloud, the Scarlet Red Ones, White, Grey faded into Black, and the EQTs. Awesome source. So, I would say, you guys take yourselves over to adidas.co.uk and you can make your own Adidas trainers and tops or whatever so warriors i've got another video coming up where i'm going to be talking about the zne hoodie and um, jacket and please stay tuned for that warriors you're the best take care and see you soon later